So here we're trying to write a vector in component form that has an initial point at 1, negative 3 and a terminal point at 5, 0. So basically what we're trying to do is move this guy, drag it back to where its initial point starts at the origin. So in our last video, the way we said we were going to do this was remember the phrase terminal minus initial. Uh, a vector in component form has a first component and a second component. To get the first component, you're going to take the terminal x value minus the initial x value. So we'll take 5 minus 1. And then for the second component, you're going to subtract the y value. So that's 0 minus negative 3. Uh, be careful with your signs and, and things like that. Uh, so finish out the algebra. 5 minus 1 is 4. 0 minus negative 3 makes positive 3. And this is our vector in component form that has this initial point and terminal point. So if I graph this real quick, go right 1, 2, 3, 4, up 1, 2, 3 for the, uh, for the terminal point, you notice that when I graph this guy, notice it's a carbon copy of the blue vector. It looks just like it. It's got the same direction, same magnitude. The only difference is, is that it's starting from the origin. And the reason this works is when we took 5 minus 1, what we were really doing was getting this distance here of 4. And when we took 0 minus negative 3, we were really getting this distance of 3 right here. And so when you write the vector 4 comma 3, then it's the same as this line segment, but starting at the origin.